Hello, and this is Sunny. Welcome back. Today, my topic is the difference between analog signal and a digital signal. We live in an analog world. Colors we see, heat we feel, sounds we make and hear are all in the form of analog signals. All analog signals carry energy. If we use voltage to represent the energy, analog signal wave should be smooth and continuous over time. By smooth and continuous, it means that within any range of analog signal wave, like from point A to B, there are infinite values in terms of voltage. A digital signal wave, on the other hand, looks like this. If we draw the graph of voltage over time, viewed from afar, the digital signal wave may look smooth and continuous. But when we look closely, there are tiny discrete steps. By discrete, it means for any range of a digital signal wave, like from point A to point B, there may be very large but not infinite number of values. Each value in voltage can be encoded in digital numbers, zeros or ones. In a simplified view, digital signals are normally represented this way because in digital signal transmission, all these values are in the form of zeros and ones. And we will talk about how to convert analog signals into digital data in a separate lesson. In summary, an analog signal can take any value within a given range of time. A digital signal can only represent one of the discrete set of values. As analog signals travel, they will become weaker and weaker. To make things worse, all kinds of interferences would create noises. To boost the fading analog signals, we need a device called an amplifier to increase their voltage. Analog signals are amplified, but at the same time, it also increases noises. Besides, the amplifier itself also adds some noises. Digital signals would also lose power over a distance. A different device known as digital regenerator is used to boost weakening digital signals. Digital regenerator, also known as a digital repeater, takes the entire digital signals and reconstructs them to their original quality. At the same time, most noises will be eliminated. I hope this video is helpful. Thank you very much and see you next time. Oh, don't forget to subscribe.